I'm going to show you how to create amazing gradient backgrounds in Photoshop with this simple trick. Let's start on a new document with just a white background layer and head over to our gradient tool. Here we can choose from one of the many preset ones in Photoshop or double click on the gradient editor to create our own gradient. And then the key to this trick is to set the blending mode to difference rather than normal. Now when you go to paint, your first gradient should pop up and then every time you do it, it will create the difference of that gradient. So you get these cool neon background colors and you can experiment with different gradients to see which ones provide the best results that you want. If I ever want to start fresh, I can just go back to my basic black and white, set it to normal, and then I'll quickly just create a white gradient here on the top. And I can just try out other ones. For example, let's see what this one looks like on difference. I can do a couple like this. This is a lot more subtle. I might appreciate this sort of gradient as well. And another tip is this is just a standard linear mode, but you can also create radial gradients. You can also create these type of angle gradients, or you can create uh, these reflected lines or star diamond gradients. So it's up to you, but just sticking with the difference mode and linear gradient, you can create some really cool results in just a matter of a few clicks. So these could make great wallpapers, backgrounds, or starting points for other type of designs. So if you enjoyed this quick trick, my name is Justin Odisho. You can check out hundreds of more on the playlist on my channel and subscribe to stay tuned for all of my new future videos. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video.